I'm pretty happy about this guy. He said that he's a Muslim free zone. He's not going to sit there and train um, people that could do harm to other people. And he's, he don't want to feel responsible. I don't blame him. But this reporter that's talking to him, okay, I'm not responsible if you lose IQ points. Once you hear her start speaking, I'm sorry. But it's got to be the stupidest thing I've ever heard in my entire life. Well, talk about total dits, okay? Listen up. Now, I have a moral and legal responsibility to ensure the safety of all patriots in my community. And so effective immediately, I'm declaring Florida gun supply as a Muslim-free zone. I will not arm and train those who wish to do harm to my fellow patriot. Andrew Hallinan, the owner of that Florida gun supply store, joins me now. Good morning. Good morning. Thanks for having me. Thanks for being here. So you're standing in front of a Confederate flag. You're banning Muslims who read Sorry, the Quran the from your off. store. Um, you want to be provocative. Why? You know, the goal of the video was to offend, uh, it was to offend as many people as I could, quite honestly, so we could start a conversation uh, about the political correctness that has become overly extreme here in the United States and uh, causing loss of life uh, uh, that, we could pre that we could prevent if we um, called, uh, you know, if we looked at uh, Islam for what it is. Okay, so I'm all for a conversation, right? But you're, you're going one step farther. You're banning Muslims who follow the Koran from your store. How do you determine which Muslim who follows the Quran? Okay, first of all, you aren't a Muslim if you don't follow the Quran. If you if you don't study the Quran, if you don't recite the Quran, if you don't follow the Quran, Sharia law, you're not a Muslim. Do you understand, dumb broad? You're you're not a Muslim. That's the stupidest thing I've ever heard. I lost IQ points on there. I thought, oh my God, I got to share this anyway. So, the guy bans the Muslims, and, you know, I don't blame him. I wouldn't want to feel responsible either if they go out and start shooting somebody, and, you know, they're dead on because you helped them learn how to shoot. So, anyway, I'm going to leave the link in the box, and I just want to share that with you because I thought it was so funny. I just had to. <laughs> Thanks for watching.